tonight, a deadly shooting outside a Clearwater convenience store is sparking protests after a man is gunned down by another man who says he fired in self-defense. The victim's community is now calling for the shooter to be arrested. Fox 13's Jordan Bowen was at the rally and joins us to explain how the community is responding. Jordan. Well, Haley, demonstrators I spoke with are calling the killing of 28-year-old Marquise McLaughlin unjustified. The man who pulled the trigger tells police he feared for his life, but some say they don't buy it. Community members with signs in hand chanting for justice Saturday and getting honks of support here outside the Circle A food store in Clearwater. What happened, what transpired over here, man, is, is wrong. It's where Thursday, security cameras caught 47-year-old Michael Draca approaching the car of 24-year-old Brittany Jacobs, while her boyfriend, 28-year-old Marquise McLaughlin, was in the store. Detectives say Draca began arguing with Jacobs because she was parked in a handicapped spot without proper tags. That's when McLaughlin leaves the store and can be seen pushing Draca to the ground. Seconds later, Draca pulls out his gun and and shoots McLaughlin in the chest. This man died for defending his family, man, for being a young father. A young man's life was taken for a senseless crime that should not have took effect. And I just want to know if it was anybody else, wife, mom, or whatever, they would have done the same thing. McLaughlin was a father of three, with a five-year-old, a three-year-old, and a newborn. Draca currently isn't facing any charges, but Stephanie Battle says she thinks that should change. You never should have approached her. You should have mind your business. If you had a problem with her parking in the space that she was in, you should have called law enforcement. And we've made attempts to get in touch with the shooter, but currently he has a sign posted on his door saying he's not making any comments at this time. Another rally is scheduled for tomorrow afternoon at 4 o'clock at the Mount Carmel Church in Clearwater. That's set to get underway at 4 o'clock. Haley? All right. Jordan, thank you.